News right now involving the Coast Guard Academy. Tonight, congressional lawmakers are accusing the new London based school of mishandling an investigation into sexual assault allegations and trying to sweep it under the rug. Channel 3's Bryant Reed is digging into this. He is at the breaking news desk with much more on this tonight. Bryant. Yes, yeah, Stephanie, today, two senators on the committee overseeing the Coast Guard Academy sent a letter to the Coast Guard demanding answers about Operation Fouled Anchor. Now, that's the Coast Guard's own six-year-long investigation into more than 100 reports of rape, sexual assault, and harassment at the academy or by academy cadets. The incidents happened between 1988 and 2006. However, the investigation didn't start until 2014. Lawmakers say that probe wrapped up in 2020, but the school never told anyone about it until just this week. Now, today, Senator Richard Blumenthal said he's outraged, saying, quote, the Coast Guard Academy's lack of transparency about the sexual assault and harassment cases is inexcusable and a symptom of disturbing cultural and institutional failures that for too long were swept under the rug. Now, in a statement late this afternoon, the Coast Guard acknowledges it did not widely disclose the investigation and added, we recognize that transparency is critical to building the trust of not only victims, but all cadets and personnel at the academy, and we are committed moving forward to be open and transparent regarding the outcomes of this process in our efforts to prevent and address this, scour this scourge. Now you can learn more about the investigation and the Coast Guard's response right now on the WFSB app. Brian Tree, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.